Good morning, everyone. It's Rainy with the American School of Hypnosis, and I'd like to welcome you to our 45-day Pick-Me-Up Happiness Challenge. And of course, the purpose of the Happiness Challenge is to help you all to be happier by conditioning you each day for 45 days, with the exception of Saturday and Sunday. So Monday through Friday, 45 days of constant affirmations, suggestions, small hypnosis sessions, and this constant suggestion creates a habit. And the habit is to be happier than you've been before. So that's the purpose. So if you haven't invited your friends yet, let them know we're on. Invite them now. <laughs> so here I am in the parking lot of the main mall in South Portland, Maine. I'm actually waiting for Reluca. She, I just dropped her off at a, I guess, a wedding dress fitting. Not for her, but for my youngest daughter who's getting married next year and uh, she's doing a fitting and all the girls she invited all her sisters and aunts that's a girl thing and uh, they're all gonna be there with her as she tries on dresses to find the best fit I told her she should get camouflage rather than white but hey I'm a guy <laughs> so she's doing that and I figured what a great time to come over here in the morning and sit in the empty parking lot because the mall hasn't opened yet. You can see there's an empty parking lot behind me. Actually, you can't see when I move. All you see is my headrest. But I'm in the parking lot in front of Macy's and there's a bookstore behind there. And it's, it's kind of interesting to be here sitting right next to the store and nobody being at the mall. That makes me happy. I'm the first one here. <laughs> So, being a premiere, this is being showed initially on a premiere, Reluca and I are watching. We're on the side over here with the text box ready to respond to anyone who is there. So let us know who you are, where you're from. We always like to see who's the furthest one away because, <coughs> excuse me, normally I say that Reluca is 20 feet away in her office, but she's not. She's actually a mile and a half away at the bridal place, a bridal store. So who's further than that? Let me know who you are, where you're from, how you're doing this morning. We always love to see your comments, respond to them. It gives us something to do, it gets my morning finger exercise typing. <laughs> so what we'd like to speak to you today about is about the word should. Do you ever feel you should be happier? You should be prettier? You should be, uh, smarter you should be a better father husband wife child whatever do you find yourself saying that i should this i should that well i'm here to tell you that if you want to be happier stop shooting on yourself what do i mean by that be who you are you can be the best who you are just by being it you don't have to set yourself up with I should be this I should be that you're setting yourself up with some unrealistic goal of how you think the perfect person should be see there I go with a should so stop shooting on yourself and stop shooting on others because sometimes we put so many shoulds or demands on ourselves that we start thinking that you should that you shouldn't do that you shouldn't say that you shouldn't be that way that we expand our shoulds elsewhere so by stopping the shoulds, you will be happier. Okay, <laughs> So do that. So what I'd like to do is do a little happy session with you this morning to help you to feel better. And our disclaimer before we start is to not listen to this or watch this video while operating a motor vehicle, while operating any dangerous equipment. Uh, do it while sitting down at home relaxing or wherever you are if you're in a car like me and you're in a parking lot where you're not going to be bothered you can sit there and relax so someplace where you won't be bothered for a little while for about five or six minutes and if you have any animals with you get them out of the room and let's go ahead and get started what I'd like you to do right now is close your eyes and take a deep breath and exhale and relax and take a second deep breath and exhale and on your third deep breath hold it for about three seconds and exhale and relax 
Just let yourself be here. Let go and enjoy this moment you've chosen for yourself. Now in just a moment, I'm gonna count from five down to one. And with each number that I say, I want you to allow yourself to relax twice as much. And any outside sounds you hear, such as the airplane going over us right now, allow them to relax you more and more. Any outside sounds can just relax you more and more. So starting with five, just let go. Go all the way down deep. Four, feeling more relaxed as you go deeper and deeper. Three, feeling wonderful, giving yourself the permission that this is what you want to do. Two, you want to be happier as you relax more and more. And finally, one, just letting yourself go. You're now in the alpha brainwave state and the alpha brainwave state is a place where you're more open to suggestion than anywhere else. You're able to hear me. You're just sitting there with your eyes closed, but you're able to use your imagination and follow what I say and imagine it as you let yourself go deeper and deeper. You feel very happy, very happy, so much happier than before. And I want you to imagine what that feels like. In fact, what would it feel like to feel the happiest you've ever been? It's fun to do that, to let your imagination go. How would it feel right now to be happier than you've ever been before? Allow yourself to experience that. It's okay to be yourself. You do the best that you can and it's fine. It's great in fact. You're the best at being you than anyone else. You are exactly who you should be at this moment. And it's okay. You accept yourself for who you are. For that wonderful, exceptional person that you are. You accept other people as they are as well. You realize that others are who they are and they shouldn't have to meet any other person's expectations. Rather than wanting people to change Accept them for who they are. It makes you feel good to be accepting and it makes them feel good to be accepted. What's your best feature? What do you like best about yourself? Think about that for a moment. Think of one thing, just, just one thing that you like best about you. It can be something as simple as your hair, your positive attitude, your dedication. What do you like best about yourself? Realizing that whatever it is that you like best about yourself, that's who you are right now. And you can accept that. And you can go on, once you're out of hypnosis, thinking about other things that are great about you as well. Because you are a wonderful person. It's okay. It's wonderful 
to be you. The unique, individual you that you are. You are happy. You are so much happier than before and you can retain this happiness. You're positive, positive minded. You look forward to wonderful things. In just a moment, I'm going to count to five and at the count of five, You'll come back to the here and now, feeling wonderful in every way. One, you're starting to emerge from hypnosis. Two, feeling wonderful in every way. Three, your mind is clear and alert. Four, your eyes are starting to open. And five, eyes wide open, fully awake and feeling fine. Hey everyone, did you forget where we were? Yes, we're in the mall parking lot still. I'd like to thank you all for being part of this program, for being part of our community at the American School of Hypnosis. We really appreciate you ha having you here. It's you that help our business to grow. You are the business, and we're here to help you as well. So if you'd like to learn more about hypnosis, look at the description below this video and you'll see all kinds of options of how you can do that including getting our free 446 page hypnosis manual all you got to do is click on the link and put in your email and it'll go right to you so we'd like to invite you to invite your friends challenge them to come to this 45 day challenge that's what it's there for to make them happy as well and please leave a comment how you're doing what you think about the program, and a thumbs up. That always helps us. You like that? It looks just like the button. A thumbs up. <laughs> so with that, you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.